Environmental Studies by Julia Persis S., Assistant Professor of English, St. Joseph's College of Arts and Science for Women Brochures. In this video, we shall see about the definition of environment, the multidisciplinary nature of environment, scope and importance of environment. Definition Environmental studies refers to the study of environment. Environmental studies deals with every issue that affects a living organism. It is a multidisciplinary approach that brings about an appreciation of a natural world and human impact of its integrity. It is an applied science. Environmental studies involve understanding human interactions with the environment. It requires an integrated approach to several disciplines of science and social approach, or it is a multidisciplinary academic field which systematically studies human interaction with the environment in the interest of solving complex problems. It is a broad study that includes the natural environment, the built environment, and the sets of relationships between them. Environment is from a French word environ, which means to encircle or surround. The surroundings or conditions in which a person, animal, or plant lives or operates. That is, all the physical and biological surroundings of an organism, along with their interactions such as atmosphere, hydrosphere, and mesosphere, which surrounds us, is known as our environment. Environment is divided into two, that is, abiotic components and biotic components. Abiotic components consist of air, water, soil, and material. The biotic components consist of plants, animals, and microbes. Study of our environment includes both physical and biological components, interaction among its components, effects of this components on human being, and vice versa. However, we cannot study environment in isolation. Environmental studies also have input from various other disciplines of sciences, engineering, social science, law, and governance. The multidisciplinary nature of environmental science is illustrated in the following diagram. Environmental science has a connection with many fields. For example, with basic and applied study, technology, management and awareness, and modeling. Environmental studies have a disciplinary nature with land science like biology, biochemistry, microbiology, etc. It also has its connection with physical science like physics, chemistry, earth science, atmospheric science. It also maintains a connection with technology such as civil, chemical, hydraulic, nano. Environmental study has also a multidisciplinary nature with management and awareness like economic, sociology, law, education, management, and mass communication. It also has a connection with modeling like mathematics, statistics, and computer science. Why we want to study the state of environment? It's for the need for information that clarifies modern environmental concepts such as the need to conserve biodiversity, the need to lead more sustainable lifestyles, and the need to use resources more effectively. A need to change the way in which we view our own environment by a practical approach based on observation and self-learning. The need to create a concern for our environment that will trigger pro-environmental action, including activities we can do in our daily life to protect it. Scope and importance. We love a natural surrounding with resources both renewable and non-renewable. 
Due to increase in population, these resources are getting depleted gradually. There is a need to understand, make ourselves aware of our own natural assets and get concerned about our environment and sustainably utilize the resources. The scope of environmental studies is very wide and nearly covers some aspects of every major discipline, biology, chemistry, physics, geography, resource management, economy, etc. By learning about our environmental studies, people will understand the concept, the need of development without destruction of the environment. It is useful in taking environmental pollution and related pollution. It helps in maintaining ecological balances. It helps to gain skills to access the environmental impact of human activities. It will help to protect biodiversity. It uses basic knowledge of environment and associated problems. It helps to achieve sustainable development. It helps to educate people regarding their duty towards the protection of environment. The knowledge of environmental science will be applied to the study of agriculture, which will be helpful to farmers. Water, air, soil, forest are all part of our life support system. Without them, life itself would be impossible. Natural resources are limited in nature and continue to shrink and maybe get a feature if not utilized in a sustainable manner. Almost every act of human being has some effect on the environment. Solid waste, water pollution, air pollution, soil pollution, etc. And these have the effect on human health. Individual efforts together with the public and also government actions are needed to protect our environment from further more degradation, degradation and degradation. For evaluation, define environmental studies. What are the scope and importance of environmental studies? Two, name one well-known environmentalist who inspires you. Why? 